Hi, I'm Taryn from Women's Day. And I'm Lori, Toy Insider Mom. Okay, Lori, so what do all of these toys have in common? Science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or STEM. Okay. These are important concepts that our kids learn in school, but what better thing as a parent to bring home than a toy that not only is fun, but that helps enforce all of these skills in our kids. So we're gonna start with tablets. Let's start with our Lee Pad Platinum, a tablet that's kid tough, shatterproof glass, um, and it's got a seven inch high resolution screen. It's Wi-Fi enabled, so that kids have access to over a thousand different apps, videos, everything, that's all LeapFrog Educator approved. What's new and exciting are the Magic Cards. So there's a camera in here that allows kids to scan. Go ahead and see if you can spell that word. Spell. There you go. Okay. Did you get it? Yep, we got a T. <laughs> so now you've spelled nets. So great content in here. And here's another one. This is called Our Little Scholar by School Zone. All the curriculum in here is for pre-kindergarten through first grade. Over $200 worth of apps and video games so parents don't have to buy anything else. It's all here. There's great engaging um, characters on the screen that will keep the kids interested and playing. Great. Disney has come up with something new called Disney Imagine Academy. And this is Mickey, and this is the Rocket Builder Ship. So what we have is our Disney app, and this is our rocket ship. Okay. Whatever we do on this ship is going to come to life in the app. So if I put the wing in, it's going to come to life right in here. Look at that. There's over a thousand different combinations that kids can make with this. So they're never going to get bored, and then Mickey's going to take them on all kinds of great adventures, teaching them about colors, numbers, and all kinds of fun stuff. Awesome. This is called Remote Control Machines Animals. It's by a company called Thames and Cosmos, and it gives kids the opportunity to really build a zoo. What kids are going to learn is how animals actually move. So the kids are putting all the pieces together, snap together pieces, then they put the skins on, and then they watch exactly how it moves. So if it's an orangutan, it's going to climb the string, or a crab moves side to side. Kids can even invent their own animals with this. Very fun. Let's talk about the supercopter. This is by Laser Pegs. In this kit, there's enough pieces of these great bricks, which are, by the way, compatible with all of the other sets like this, to build 30 different models. Once kids are done creating the copter, we can add light and lift off. <laughs> <laughs> so STEM toys are always geared to boys and girls, but in the past it's been a lot towards the boys. So we see companies that really have girls in mind, mm -hmm. like what Lego did when they introduced the Friends line. In the Friends line, the main character is Emily. And now Emily has been transported into this fantasy world of elves. It's all about the movement. It's about connecting it, building the story, but also about the movement. So we have a magic bridge over here that turns into a ladder. We have a bucket that you can pretend that there's water in and bring that up and down. And it's a beautiful, beautiful playhouse. And then we have another new line called Mighty Makers by Connects. So this is all about connecting all the connector pieces building the Ferris wheel, you can build an entire amusement park, and again, it's all about the movement. And you'll see that Emily is in here with her favorite little teddy bear that she I doesn't leave that. home without. <laughs> this is great. Now we know that kids are gonna be making their own toys very soon with 3D printers. This just blows my mind, Lauren, <laughs> that this is in the near future. With the 3D printer from Tech for Kids. So what kids do is they take this gel, and they put it on the templates that come with this. They put it into the chamber that you can hold this way, Mm -hmm. or this way. Okay. They leave it in for about a minute. It's an LED light that turns the gel into this hard plastic. In this case, they fill the mold, then they use the gel in the middle, put it back into the chamber so that they have this three-dimensional fish. And finally, stop action movies. So this is called stick bots. Let me give you one of these guys. These are really cute. Um, what we do is we get our stick bot, we download the free app, and kids are actually moving these guys, taking a picture, moving them again, take a picture, and the app will automatically stitch these pictures together. Then kids go to hashtag stickbot, they share it for other people to see, and they can see what everyone else around the world is doing with these guys. That's fun. And these have suction cups for hands suction and feet. Suction cups, yep. So this way you can really pose them any way you want. You, you know, kids will start posing them simply, but then they'll start adding backgrounds and doing a lot of fun stuff with them. That's really fun. Uh, as are all of these great toys, Lori, thank you so much. Oh, thank you. And if you need any more information, you can head over to womansday.com. And toyinsider.com.